Hello and welcome back and in this video I'm going to be highlighting everything that we ate in Portland and Bar Harbor, Maine. So I hope you're hungry and let's get right into it. Our lunch on our first day in Portland was at High Roller Lobster Company. This is off of Exchange Street in the shopping and food district of Old Port, Portland. Now I know you're probably wondering, why didn't you get lobster here? But it was honestly kind of expensive and I know that that's just lobster for you. But we decided to try the crispy chicken sandwiches instead. They were pretty standard as far as a chicken sandwich goes. However, the fries were really delicious. They had an Old Bay seasoning on them, and I thought it gave it just a nice touch and different from what we're used to here in the Midwest. Also, something that is really popular in Maine are whoopie pies. So I decided to try one here as well. The first place I went to was not open, and I think that they taste just like a hostess cupcake, if I'm being honest. They were really good and really rich, and I don't think one person could eat them, so they're perfect for sharing. Next up was the Holy Donut, and we ate this for breakfast on our way out of Portland. It's a super popular spot, and what makes them so different from other donuts is the dough is made from mashed potatoes. It creates a healthier, lighter option, and I got the sea salt chocolate caramel, which was absolutely delicious, as well as the pomegranate, which was also really good, but I actually prefer the chocolate donut over the pomegranate. So next time you're in Portland, you should definitely try this out. It's a main thing, and I felt like it was worth a stop. Next up, we headed to Bar Harbor, Maine, which is just outside Acadia National Park. And for lunch our first day, we went to Cherry Stones which is a kind of bar and grill type place, but they have a lot of seafood options. And I was hungry for fish and chips, and both me and my husband got this, and we thought it was pretty delicious. It was nice and light and fried. Um, the fries weren't anything special, but the fish was definitely very good. And if you're looking for some place that isn't too busy and is pretty moderately priced, that's definitely some place I would recommend in Bar Harbor. Our lunch slash dinner for our second day in Bar Harbor was at Leary's Landing Irish Pub. I ordered a classic, the bangers and mash. Um, my food tasted good initially, but it did make me sick later on in the day. So for that reason, I can't recommend this spot. My husband got a hamburger and he enjoyed his food. It didn't make him sick. But um, that's just something that happened to me, and I'm always honest in sharing my experience. So you may have a very different um, time if you go to Leary's Landing, but for me, I can't recommend it based on the fact that their food did give me food poisoning. But we'll end this video on a sweet note and talk about Mount Desert Island ice cream. This is a lovely little ice cream shop in Bar Harbor, and they have a couple other locations in the state as well. They make homemade ice cream with some very unique flavors. Um, it's all handmade and hand scooped, and I tried the lemon curd with coriander, and it was absolutely refreshing and delicious. So that is one place that you need to try whenever you're in Bar Harbor or if you find one of their other locations in Maine. As always, thank you for watching my channel and I hope that you will like and subscribe and be on the lookout for more content coming very soon. Thank you for watching.